What's up you guys, Gaming Radio here, welcome back to the new Minecraft tutorial. As you can see we are going to create simple enderman farm, this is actually means ender pearl and lots of XP. You can easily get 30 XP just spending 5 minutes on this farm. Before I'm going to start this farm, you have to kill the ender dragon to create this farm. If you don't kill ender dragon, it will not work. So let's see what we are going to use for this farm. First you need diamond sword, I recommend you put sharpness 5 on it. Anvil, name tag, 2 decoration block, which is stone brick and stone brick slab. You can select different kind of block and slab, it's just for decoration. Oak leaves, chest, normal rail, water bucket, oak fence, oak tractor, you can select different kind of tractor if you want, torch, minecart, hopper, carpet, color doesn't matter, you can select uh, any color you want, and ender pearl. So if you're ready, let's get started. First you need to go deep from this island for getting more endermans. If you are in survival mode, you need water bucket. Just put water on the last block on the island, select your arc leaves and go deep as much as you can like in the video. So water stops here. Just use your arc leaves again to get 150 plus blocks away from the island. The reason I'm using arc leaves just because endermans and other things can't be spawned on this block. I'm going about 200 blocks far for safety. You can press F3 on your keyboard to look how many blocks you far from the island. When you finish, just put 5 blocks to each side, length will be 10 blocks. After that, put arc leaves to each side of the rectangle and fill the inside with stone bricks. Make sure you put few torches to get rid of enderman spawn. So we are done for enderman spawning area, now we are going to make trap area for endermans. Just go about 10 blocks away from the place we created and put 3 blocks on each side, length will be 11 blocks, don't forget to fill the inside. When you're done, just go to the entrance of the place we created and put one arc leaves on the middle and two more blocks on each side of it. That's the stairs for endermans, just make three block size stairs like this.
Then add 3 more blocks and cover top of them with the same arc leaves block. Switch it to arc tractor and put the each side of the top blocks. You can close and open these trapdoors whenever you want. I'm going to keep this open for now. After that, remove 6 blocks for hoppers under the trapdoor and few extra blocks for the chest. First I am going to put two big chests and one little chest on the middle. You can put lots of chests if you want. Switch it to the hopper and before you put the hopper just make sure you hold shift key on your keyboard. Put six hopper on the empty place. I'm going to cover the hoppers with the carpet, color doesn't matter, because when you kill endermans some of XP's will stack on the hoppers, you can fix it by adding the carpet on the hoppers. I'm going to use black color. When you finish adding hoppers and the chest, just use arc leaves to add few extra blocks on the top. Skip one block and replace stone brick with the three blocks high. You can remove bottom ones after get one block on the air. I'm going to cover the single block like that for now. We will remove it after we got the endermite. Just throw few ender pearl until you get the endermite. You can kill endermans to get the ender pearl. It's not hard to get this on this island. As you can see I already got the endermite. You need to give name on it if you want the farm work. For that just put the anvil anywhere you want, put the name tag on the first section and write anything you want as a name. I am going to write endermite. After that just right click on the endermite with the name tag and give the name. Then put the normal rails on the stone bricks. On the rail we are going to use minecart to get the endermite inside of it. As you can see it's very simple. When you're done you can remove extra blocks and cover only the back side of the endermite. Make sure the front side is open so enderman can see the endermite and go inside of the trap. Ok guys it's almost done, I'm going to add few extra decoration blocks. It's the optional, you can design your farm as you wish. But make sure you are using slab because endermans and others can't be spawned on this slab. I am going to use torch on the fence for 100% of safety. 
When your decoration ready, just remove the torch from the first place and wait for the endermans to go inside of the traps. When you got them, use your diamond sword with the sharpness 5 to kill and gain some XP's. All the ender pearls will go to the chest. You can use it for teleporting in survival mode. Ok guys, that's all for this tutorial, I hope you enjoy. If you do, just smash the like button and subscribe if you don't already. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.